Hey y'all, um, it's Saturday, so um, who's ready for a Ray Dunn haul? So it's a small one this week because I really was only on the hunt for Halloween stuff. Specifically the Halloween mugs, the large letter, long letter Halloween mugs. So, Monday. Sunday I didn't go hunting because... I was busy I'm gonna show you at the end what I was busy doing so Monday I thought I would venture out to the most southern point part of my state I haven't been there hunting so I was like we gonna find stuff um, first so I went I found one thing I, I so I passed up things that maybe I shouldn't have, but because I really only wanted the Halloween stuff. So I passed up on a lemonade pitcher, but it wasn't the ceramic one. It was the uh, melanine, the plastic one. So I passed up on that and there was something else I passed up on. I don't know. But the first store I went to, um, somebody's shopping cart was standing in the aisle. But I think it belonged to the store because it had a bunch of crazy stuff in it. And I got this magnolia basket, medium size. Now I had the large one before and now this is the medium size. I started to fill it up with my mugs. So that was the first store. Second store, I hit nothing. Stuff I already had, like the spoon rest, a ton of the stuff that I had just purchased. And then I finally found the matches, these ones. The matches and the glass. I really wanted to get the Ignite one, but they didn't have it, so I picked Fire. They had tons. I don't, on the back, there is the where you light it, and they're $4.99. But they have so many there. Now they are up here where I live, too. So... They have tons, tons of saying, flame, fire, I, I don't know. So I got that. So then I was like, before I turn around, let me go to one more store. Home goods. Home goods. First I walk in, I spot these. I needed some more of these little raised mini cupcake holders. Um, They were $1.99 each, so I got two. So, yay. And then mug aisle, I'm straight to the mug aisle, and I got um, a crazy one and a red mine, and they were both $5.99. And then on the floor, in like the bathroom aisle, I found this fork, knife, spoon. So I've been wanting that too. And so I'm going to the register, standing in line. What do I see? A Ray Dunn Halloween mug. Yay, I got excited. I bought it. And the reason it's not here for me to show you guys, I took a picture I will show at the end, is because I returned it. Because it's not what I wanted. It's the roundish, smaller mugs. It had color inside. And it had a pumpkin on the front. And But it's not... I'd rather save my $5.99 for... Um, the mug that I really want instead of spending $5.99 on a mug that I'm just gonna get for two, yeah, two and half. I didn't even think it was cute. So I returned it. Still looking for the radon Halloween stuff. So Tuesday I didn't go, Wednesday. Wednesday I went, uh, no, Wednesday didn't go either. Thursday. Thursday. Because I was um because nobody, you know, join your local Facebook group and people will post when stuff has been spotted. And none of that none of the Halloween marks have been spotted in my state. All over the country, but not my state. So So I was a little bit depressed. I was done hunting for a couple of days Thursday. I had to pick up my daughter, but before I went to pick her up, I said, let me go just go to that marshal around the corner. So we found rest. I have spoon, I have rest now. Yes, 
They had tons of that there. Tons. Pitches galore. Um, um, what are they called? It's ceramic pitches. But then I saw this. Pour. I like this one. I really like this one. And the last thing I got was... Smear. I really love that one. Oh, so much better than spread and butter. And people have been saying that this looks like a nipple. I don't know. But it's smaller than the um the the older um butter holders. But I really I really like this one. So this is cute. And this one was $9.99. So um Today, sat, I didn't go hunting on Friday, and I went today to three different locations, and nothing, nothing. You know, you get excited, you think you see something in the Halloween section, but nothing. Home Goods tricked me the other day. I walked in straight to the, towards the Halloween section, and I saw a radar mug with color inside. I was like, oh, and then I saw it says, Bliss. Nope, it wasn't blue. It said relax. I, I had the wrong with the blue inside. Relax. I was like, oh, psych. Nope, didn't happen. So, anywho, so that was my redone haul for the week. But on Saturday, I showed you guys last week that I bought this Rust Oleum, the black paint for my for my container. So I've been painting. I painted them over the weekend, and they turned out great. But let me tell you, I thought I was being smart by getting a big plastic bin and putting it on my deck putting the canisters inside and spray painting them and then putting the lid on it but just open a crack so the fumes can escape because oh, i'm so smart what i forgot to do was check the forecast and as i'm perusing around town thunder rain i come home the bin is filled the bottom of the bin is has standing water in it so I also spray painted the little platter. I don't know where that is right now. But that one has a bunch of bubbles on it. But I, I don't mind. I don't mind. It's I might, I might sand it and we spray, but that's fine. It's it gives a character. But the canisters I did and they turn out great. I love how the mat the mat brings out the the dimples. So it's really cute. So I did one and the other one. And it's, I don't know why this one is smoother than this one. Uh, I think this one, that's the one that was out in the rain. But yeah, I have to, I have to touch up right here. But anyway, so I already ordered um, decals for that. So they should be coming next week. Fingers crossed. Um, <laughs> Christmas. Anyway. All right. So I'm going to let you go now. Hopefully next week there will be some real way down Halloween stuff in my state, in my stores that I go to. Because I'm tired of this. I just, I'm like, I want the pumpkin spice. I want the fall, y'all. I want the... Somebody was going to trade me a potion one with the purple inside for my toss and stuff. But um, luckily I did, a re did some research online. So there are two different types of potion. I believe the last year one um you know how the letters are large like that i believe last year's one was just a little bit shorter so next to you if you put them next to each other you can tell the difference so i emailed her i'm like is it the one with the larger ones or with the little shorter ones it's the one with the shorter ones i was like no fast we want the large ones the larger ones i just don't like that when the letters are shorter no don't cut the letters off it's cute. That's what we go hunting for. All right. All right. That's it for today. Um, have a great weekend. And I will see you again next Saturday. Bye, guys. <laughs>